Hello and welcome to another Caster Chronicles unboxings today with Gold Rush Casters. Now this is only my second box from the Casters Chronicles. The first box had some, I think two nice Isis cards, Egyptian themed cards for my collection. But besides that, I was quite, quite underwhelmed, I would say. Uh, there's like not a not much difference between the rarities, no texture on the higher hits. And this set again, we have secret rares and HR rarities as the highest rarities. I don't remember how many I got in my first box. It's quite like some months ago. I think at least one secret and two HR, but I could be wrong. And yeah, we had like quite some quite some dupes so yeah let's see i don't think we have like more more isis cards because yeah i i don't know the the background behind casa chronicles but it feels like they also use like the same or partly it's the same artwork like force of will yeah because the isis artworks um are the same artworks like in force of will so yeah, what is R, R2, no, I, Isu? Yeah, I need to, what? I need to learn Katakana again. What is this egg? This reminds me of the, the funny egg and there was one in Shadowverse Evolve. This looks super creepy. Funny that the art style or the way this artwork is drawn is actually good. Like a lot of the... Uh, a lot of the force of will art is a little bit like lacking of shading and yeah it's it's not that good from the art like maybe it's just that they they give some artists a chance that are less experienced oh but this this looks cool too so maybe there's like some kind of fairy tale theme is it like the the cat in the boots, or what's the English word? Yeah, the English name for it. Was it pass in boots? Pussy in boots? I don't know. Should be like from uh, Brother Grimm, right? Man, I'm not good with fairy tales. Another kitty cat. And the bunny, which looks like from could be like from Alice. There's the Alice character in Force of Will 2. And another rare. So yeah, the foil cards are only only rare so far. Yeah, and this one has like the fitting for the gold, like the gold coins in the background. Besides that, not so exciting. Okay, we get more of the Alice theme. And I would guess that this artwork is from from Force of Will 2. Okay. So there's a fairy tale theme. Oh, I like these cards. They are well made. Good artwork. The pigs and uh, a wolf in the background. And okay, already a duplicate. Yeah, I said it in the beginning. I, I had my issues with uh, dupes in the first box too. Okay. Red Hood? She looks a little bit like Red Hood. Or the Red Hood werewolf version. Yeah, there's also a wolf in the background. Now oh, this is another cool artwork. Another cat. Uh, what is this? A secret. Okay. Yeah. As I said, the, the higher rarity, they don't have any special treatment, like no texture, no gold stamp effect. This is really sad. Because, yeah, this card says secret, but... Yeah, there's like... It's more of a full art version, so there is like a frame missing or something. But besides the full art version, there's like nothing... Nothing special about a secret rare. I think this is like for, for one of the highest possible pulls. It's yeah, really sad. Like 
doesn't feel special. And this is like a gothic Alice. But this is not Alice. This is Hori. Oh, Hori. It's okay. I don't know. It's cute. There's something written in English. How much is your budget? Oh, what is this? Is there are like different languages? What is this? Ik zal de juwelen halen. Okay, is this... Which language is this? Maybe we get some cards with uh, German too. Oh, is this for my Egypt collection? Probably not. I don't know. And another rare with this gold. And she has a staff with a donut. That's cute. I still think the the symbols are like too dominant, like too too big. Not really my style. Okay, creepy. There is a maid in the background. Yeah, there are like some some nice artworks in this one. That's super rare. Yeah, you can tell that it's super rare again from nothing. Oh yeah, similar to set number. Or I don't know if it was the the first set I opened. I don't know the right number. Of it, but yeah, we get like some more witch character styles. Oh, this looks not good. This looks cheap. And there is this is probably Russian. So we get like different languages on the card. Did I miss something? No. Oh, a big gold coin. And this from Alice again. And the super rare. Oh, that's cute. And yeah, this TCG is not that actually. Like, it's super niche. I don't know if there are actual tournaments in Japan, but I think two months ago it got like the another release or another set. But it, it's quite pricey. It was like, it was a special set and one one pack was like 2,000 yen, which is crazy much since, uh, yeah. Sometimes I get boxes on sale for 2,000 yen and this is just one pack. Oh, this is a cute, a cute frog or a toad, just rare. Uh, this looks CGI ugly. And more duplicates. I don't know how many times we have already pulled this guy, like four times. Another rare. She looks cool. And yeah, uh, I just have one more Astra Chronicle box after this one. Okay, creepy. And then, yeah. Not sure if I will ever open this TCG again. Maybe if nobody buys the, the special set and it falls in price, like I I don't want to pay so much for one booster pack. But yeah, maybe if there is like a sale for it, I will pick some up. Maybe in the in the special set we get like some special treatment like texture or gold stamping. But I wouldn't expect it. Another super rare. Oh, she has like... Qua uh, Medicina Foresti. Oh, is this like uh, Italian? I would guess it's Italian, but... Not sure. Modups. And another super rare. Uh, and the lack of, of texture, like this is something about zillions of enemy X that I love so much that the high rarities, they have such a great special treatment and it, you really feel 
when you pull something, uh, some some high rarity card. That's such a big difference. Oh, that's cute. Reminds me of the the Niffler or what's like the the cute animal and uh, fantastic beasts Harry Potter. Another dupe. And two packs left. So far we only got a one secret. No HR at all. So maybe I, I just was lucky with my HRs. Another dupe. Some last pack magic, please. Not that just, just one secret per box. Oh, we get another of these. So yeah, I guess I, I was just lucky with my first box. With all the high hits, this time only one secret. But yeah, let me know what uh, what do you think about the artwork or this TCG, or if you know something about it. Please let me know in the comments too, and yeah, see you in my next unboxing. Bye.